To create a user and query search, you must log in as an admin. The next step is to navigate to the Administration tab. You can get there by clicking the wrench icon at the bottom of the page, the Asset Setup and Server Configuration link in the Query Search Launcher module, or the Administration option in the drop down from the wrench icon at the top of the page. Once you've navigated to the Administration page, you will see a list of options in the Administration tree on the left. To create a new user, click the Users link under the Users and Agents node. The Users tab displays all of the user information and current users in Query Surge. To add a new user, click the Add button on the bottom of the page. The Add User window will pop up with red asterisks denoting required fields to complete. First, select a role for the new user. There are three different roles in Query Surge. The admin role has complete access to all of Query Surge's functionality plus access to the administration page. The read-only role can only run reports and will not be able to make changes to any existing items in Query Surge. The user role has the full functionality of Query Surge without any administrative privileges. After selecting the appropriate user role, enter the user's first name, last name, username, and password. You must enter the password again to confirm it. The remaining fields are optional. Once all of the information is entered, click Save. The new user has been added to the Users tab. Note that there is a limit for the number of users in Query Surge based on the license. You can find the user limit under the License Information link in the administration tree on the left. The number of seats is the number of users you are allowed to have. In this case, the number of users cannot exceed 5 or else an error message will occur. Thank you for watching the Creating a User tutorial.